are driving to our new property that we just purchased that technically technically we have seen it but we don't know what it looks like so we purchased a lot in Mexico near where we live now nearby but in a different town and uh, it is what 4300 4, square meters which is just a smidge over an acre in size it's uh, 50 meters wide by 86 meters I guess deep or long yeah. so about 4300 square meters and it's pure jungle so we have been told that uh, by the previous owners and several other people in town that there are caves on this property, maybe three or four caves. Um, we don't really know what that means. We haven't seen that. We yet. don't know their definition of caves. We don't know if it's a hole in the ground or it's actual little cliffs. We know it's not high up because the property looks kind of flat, but we don't know if it's like rocks where you can you know go under or you can see under or anything like that so that's what we don't know but once they said um, that there were three to four caves on there we looked at each other and we're like we got it we want it because we like crazy non normal non traditional yeah stuff so we, we like to challenge so yeah, I would say too, like it's taken a couple months to get this property actually purchased. Right. So we've known about it for a while, but we, you know, kind of the back and forth, we didn't really know if it was going to work out. But anyways, kind of the thrill of not even knowing what it is probably kept us in. Well, yeah, and that, and we've heard that a, uh, a builder, or, our builder actually inquired about it. And when he heard about the caves, he said no. Yeah, developer. Or developer, yeah. That was building a couple properties so, um, down. The, he actually bought a lot down the street from it. That so while we think we can do it, we don't know, but <laughs> we'll figure it out. We've got a, a great mason. He's fantastic. His name's Alfredo. Uh, and we and obviously we asked him, can we? If you know, depending on where they're situated inside that acre, you know, can we build no matter what? He goes, yeah, we'll figure it out. So, we'll figure it out. Yeah, we, we, I, I trust him with uh, my house. So anything that he, he can do, he'll figure it out. And uh, of course we have an electrician and a plumber ready. And uh, what we're gonna do is we are going to build a two and a half, sorry we're driving, it's kind of bumpy. But we're gonna drive a, a, a build a <coughs> two and a half meter tall wall all the way around the property with a, a, a gate in the middle or maybe in the middle or to the side wherever we think that it's easiest to drive in and uh, we'll go from there so it's going to take a while for the, these videos to be published because it's going to be such a slow start today is saturday tomorrow we have another friends of ours that's going to come out with a 10-man crew and clear out the lot completely um, i told him not to to um cut down any trees or any kind of palm trees or luscious you know really cool looking plants true trees and plants that are you know four to five inches as big or bigger do not cut those down what I really want to do is to get all the, the weeds and like the weed trees that have just been so overgrown they look like trees but they're not so uh, don't worry we are gonna replant we're gonna replant some what, what do we want we want a mango tree we want a lemon and lime tree Sour, one of those sour orange trees. Yeah, that's they, good for ceviche. Yeah. But uh, we think there's already an a big avocado yeah, tree based on what we can see. We think that's what that from is. From the street, it looks it looks pretty tall, and they and they were telling us we think that's an avocado, but we couldn't get up it, close to it to see. Yeah, it wasn't in bloom at the time, right. or you know, these last couple months. It, there, it's not in season right now. So, uh, well, there there should be some evidence on the ground uh, once we get there, but. We can't see the ground yet, so. There's a, a we, from the from the street, you can kind of see kind of see through. And what are those ones that you really like? The snake plants or whatever they're called. Oh yeah, snake plants. They're really pretty natural snake plants. So tomorrow, when um, the guys are there, I'm gonna be with them, 
you know, kind of saying yes, no, or if it's a, if it's a, just a big patch of snake grass or snake plants or whatever it's called, um, and we can kind of get around not cutting those down, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to have them leave it, but if it's just too much weeds and everything, it's just going to overtake it anyway, I might just I have to, but we can replant some, so. Uh, what else? We couldn't get a drone because we don't understand if you can or can't. We've got to do more research on that. For, for some reason, we think that foreigners can't have um, drones here, or there's a size discrepancy. You have to, it has to be under a certain size. So, I don't know. We, we, it, we thought it'd be a lot easier if we could see the property, if we could you know, fly it above it and, and see it by that way, but we, we didn't have the opportunity to do that. So, um, maybe if we figure it out and do more videos and we can get one, then we'll maybe we can get one later. So tomorrow is cleaning day and then I don't know when Alfredo can do the wall, maybe a week or two. So this, this video won't go up, you know, just because there's not a lot in, in it and not a lot to see. We're just, we're still about, um, eight minutes from, from it, from the property. And, um, <laughs> we'll show you when we get there. Yeah. So, we'll show you when we get there. Here we go. All right, we're just now pulling in to the town. Uh, it's not too far up here. We got probably a couple blocks and take a left and a right, so we'll see exactly where we're at. Mexico loves what they call topes, topes, which are speed bumps. Uh, so I guess they would rather put those around so you can't really speed than have cops running around with radar detectors and pulling people over. So you know you can't go too fast because there's another one coming up. So All right, the land's going to be over here to the right. We're going to take a Right at this auto sign. And there it is. <laughs> See the jungle to the right? That's this it. This or the earth. So we believe it starts right, right here somewhere. And it goes all the way. We'll get out and walk it to to here to the side of this house. Right, you want to get out? Okay, so this is it. So when I said palm trees, you see this big look. I, what are these called? Fan palms or something? I don't know. What that one is. So all these big trees up here are. Uh... Hola. Um, the ones we're going to keep, but all these trash trees we're going to get rid of. And it goes all the way. Is this the tree that they thought was a... Yeah. So this one, where am I? Right there. This is the one they thought that was a avocado tree. Could be. So this is all we could see. So when we say sight unseen, it's, um, it is, really, because we don't even know if the big set of trees back here are on the property or not. Um, so we just, we're just taking a leap of faith here. Um, so it goes all the way, I think to right, we believe, yeah, right here. There's a little rock wall here that goes in, so I think that's where our property is. Sorry, I'm in the middle of it. delivering chips um, so we think going that way and then 50 meters past Mindy down there so um, that's it that's all we've seen so we're excited tomorrow the guys are gonna come in let me see where I can see those snake plants I was telling you about uh, where were they 
I uh, uh, can't remember where they were. Uh, I don't know. See, there's another another palm tree next to the. Uh, ho hopefully, that is avocado tree. We love some guacamole, so. There's one over there. Let me see if I can get, get close. But that's it. That's all we've seen. So tomorrow. I will get out here with the guys and uh, we'll see what it looks like when we can get to actually step in here. So these are our rocks <laughs> that came with the place. So I think we have to use those to uh, build the, the wall. But that's it for now. And uh, I'll get, yeah, huh? I think this has been cut. Has this been cut? Maybe when the appraiser came uh, a couple weeks ago. Yeah. Uh, can that, you see down there? That does look like a... Yeah, and look right here, like right there. See how that is a big drop? So the caves might be up front, you think? I think so. I definitely think in this corner. Yeah, this was not like this when we offered, <laughs> offered on house. Here in a couple weeks. Yeah, this, so when the appraisers came out, I guess they did, they had to, because this wasn't here. Yeah, it wasn't like this. I mean, so I these are, these are some snake plants right here. Yeah, and right here. Oh yeah, right there, but the ones that I saw, oh. This whole thing right here. Yeah, it's a big section. That guy on the motorcycle just pulled over to talk to me. He said, um, he said this is a nice lot. And oh. I said, yes, we like it. He, he said, uh, maybe you're going to buy it. So, of course, I said yes. Yeah. But then he said, uh, it's big. He said, it goes 100 meters. Oh, really? So, so close. Said, yeah, it's but look, yeah, there's a, I think this is a cave, guys. This will be, and it's full of trash. So I guess the neighbors have been throwing trash in it. Yeah, I mean, but that's okay. So we can get that cleaned up tomorrow. Um, what? So thorny. Yeah. Oh, look at that huge iguana. Hold That's as big as a dog. You see it? Oh, I wish I could. Oh, we can't see crap, man. This video is going to suck. Well, like you can't, it won't shoot through. Yeah, the weeds. The weeds. Yeah, that's a good cave. That, that is a cave right there. I bet. Ah, this weed was not going to be very good. Sorry, guys. Uh, Pretty better tomorrow. Yeah, so this video sucks right now. You can't see through the weeds, so even though they cleared this out a little bit, it still doesn't help us because we still don't know what we just purchased, so... This one looks like, I don't know if you can see this rock. It looks like it's pointing out a little bit. So we might have a pretty cool little cave here. Oh can you see it? Oh my gosh. What? It goes far. What? The cave. Does it? So what, we're gonna build a bridge over it? Oh my gosh, look. Is it cool? Duper 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 far. <laughs> <laughs> well, we'll have to build a super duper duper bridge. The tree, this, this tree right here, yeah. it's in the cave. Sweet. She's talking about this tree right here. So. I hope these aren't that, those uh, cha uh, trees, the poison ones. Well, yeah. I've been touching them. Ew. All right, well, let's get out of here, and uh, yeah, we'll can bring... You see this? Yeah. Look at that, and see how that's three deep? Yeah. Sweet. Holy macaroni. This can be sweet. <laughs> I guess on the other side, though, it's flat, yeah. so... Yeah, I wouldn't mind if all the caves were up front. Yeah. So... We'll figure it out. Well, guys, you just saw with us the first time we've seen it so uh. Uh. I think this is a, uh, Coco okay. all right guys we'll uh, we'll come back out here and we'll we'll shoot some tomorrow and I think in the, the next day I think they said that it'd take Sunday Monday maybe Tuesday to get it all cleared out and then we'll show you some more all right We'll holler at y'all later.